How terrifying is a tire explosion, really? It's often said that the blast is comparable to C4 explosives, with enough energy to blow a person apart. To test this myth, Adam decided to run an experiment using a semi-truck. But blowing out a tire on a moving truck is extremely dangerous, so Adam designed a treadmill-like setup instead. First, the drive wheels of a small truck were placed into a pit. Then, the test truck's tire was pressed against those drive wheels. Once the small truck's engine was started, its wheels drove the larger truck's tire, causing it to spin. This allowed them to simulate a truck traveling at speed. Next, a mannequin riding a motorcycle was positioned beside the tire to observe what kind of injuries a tire explosion might cause to a person. The method for triggering the explosion was simple and brutal. They fired a shotgun directly at the tire, but the result wasn't the violent blast they had imagined. High-speed footage showed that when the bullet struck the tire, no debris was thrown outward at all. As a result, the mannequin was completely unharmed. To make sure the tire actually exploded, Adam used a grinder to wear away the outer rubber, exposing the steel belts inside and pushing the tire to the brink of failure. Then, a heater was used to slowly heat the tire, causing it to warp and deform, with the goal of triggering a catastrophic rupture. Ten minutes into the experiment, even though the tire temperature reached 200 degrees Celsius, there were still no signs of an explosion. So they brought out an air compressor and increased the tire pressure. Yet once again, the attempt failed. Although the tire was damaged, it merely split open along the cut. Clearly, this still wasn't the dramatic result they were expecting. Next, they prepared to carry out their most brutal and final test. 